Hello and welcome to episode 2 of me, Sui, playing Soda Story Brewing Tycoon or Brewing Master Brewing Brewing Tycoon. Right, Brewing Tycoon. Yeah, brewing. <laughs> that was Sue Boy in the background if you guys are unaware. Fruit soda breakthrough through. Interesting. Anyway. I want to increase the automation so I can get towards having the uh, garden bot. That's my main priority right now. Because that increased automation sounds so nice. But yeah, it's been like five minutes since the last video in my experience. So I know exactly what's going on. <laughs> There you go. Alright. So we need lemon. We need a lime. These are the wrong way around, apparently, it matters. And we gotta go to our fridge here. How's our bot doing? Doing good. I got an email. Daily summary, I don't care. Alright. Oh, I have the money for uh the manual one. I'm gonna try doing just plain yogurt. Just something to do while I wait, you know? See how much these sell for. 966. Wow. That's good. Interesting. So that can increase the speed I'm uh, doing better at for sure. Because uh, this is going to make it so that we're like way further on the money amounts. Because even though this thing kind of sucks, it does let me just kind of push out some when I have a lot of one ingredient or whatever. Because that thing is slow. Uh, it's a problem, it's just it is slow. Alright, so I used all of our yogurt. Yep. That's gonna make us some good money. You know? You saw Popeyes coming for you? Or aren't you glad you're brewing soda? I hate it. I will do some gardening. I didn't finish. <laughs> I started running away too soon. All right, and we'll fully water everything to 100%. Hold a 99. My brew ran out of ingredients. Oh no. All right, sorry about that. You guys didn't notice much, but you might have heard like a phone ringing or something. I got a phone call, so I had to take it. We are back. Although like I'm saying we're back, but for you guys, it was like a second. I don't know. I'm not good at this whole re YouTube recording thing yet, man. It's, it's hard, honestly. Way harder than Twitch streaming. Twitch streaming, I just get to be myself and like I don't have to 
you know, it's live, so people are a lot more patient and willing to deal with, like, slow moments. But on YouTube, that's not the case as much. You know? Breaking the fourth wall a bit here. <laughs> okay. Oh, uh, there's, like, a certain stack size for everything. I see... Oh, but I can buy that garden plot. Hello, Suey. Hopefully you remember me. Farmer Dawn, okay? I run the farm you worked at when you first got set inside. You seem to enjoy getting your hands dirty, so I'm sure you will do, do well on prison ears. I have a favor to ask of you if it's not too much trouble. In favor, in return, I can send through some cash and fruit flavor essence. I have an oversupply of fruit and vegetables. They're just not that popular these days. If you could somehow drum up some interest by creating a fruit a soda that has only fruit and vegetable flavors in it, I would be most grateful. Thanks and good luck. Okay. Well, this bear is just going well. Has an error called... I don't have lime right now. That's a problem. I guess we'll just start a different one. I need a fruit and a veggie one. So, we'll create a new soda recipe. Pause. New soda recipe. Green machine. There you go. It'll be avocado and lime. Okay. Effects unknown. We'll find out in a second here. I have a shovel? That's cool. I don't really need it right now, so I'll pop it in here. So I need another brewer. Which, they're kind of expensive, being 333. So does this, like, slowly research itself over time? Like, how do you learn more about it? You know? Hmm. I'm trying to figure that out. I don't understand how the recipes work. Do you just eventually find one? How do you analyze it? So many questions. <laughs> Not many answers. Okay, so... This one is... Avocado spinach. It's fruit and vegetable flavors. Oh, you just have to wait for it to happen. Okay, okay, I get it. I'll grab something that I have a full stack of. Actually, we'll go garden first. Can't wait to have the garden bot, honestly. It's gonna be such a nice thing. I assume I'll get like a stupid amount of money eventually, but it seems like it's a bit slow at first, which I mean makes sense. Most games run that way. You gotta have some sort of progression, you know? Yeah, I'm getting the garden bot next for sure. We're almost leveled up, so that's exciting. Alright. 
Put everything away. So what do I have a full stack of? Okay. Yeah, so those are like full stacks. So I guess I'll do a cabbage one. Just get rid of this stack of cabbage real quick. Can I program you to also see that as an output? No, it's only one. That's fine. I was just seeing. Alright, so we'll just do some of these. Speed up our money making a bit. I don't know how much these are worth, but it doesn't really matter. I also need to do this, but I need more money to be able to do it. Okay. So that's probably enough cases to ship for the time being. They sell pretty well, so that's nice. They're not as good as our uh, super fancy ones made from here, but there's something. Wonder if I can eventually get the rat and like get some kind of essence from it, you know? enough yeah so we're gonna have to give it a little bit to catch up because we only pick up five per okay so to get the next brewer I need 333 I'll go ahead and garden oh I level up Garden bot. There we go. Garden bot is unlocked in the build book. All right. I don't see garden bot. Oh no, he's right here. Three hundred ten. Yeah, I'm gonna do the garden bot first. I feel like that's gonna actually be the smarter decision. then have them store in here. There you go. So I don't have to worry about gardening at all. That'll be very nice. I think anyway. Yeah, he's doing his thing. Look at that. Boom. Then I'll go put them away. Dude, that's so nice. No, I can't have him do that. Okay. Because I think I'm going to need a soda bot. No, you're a soda bot. Oh, right. There was like an inventory one. So we'll have to worry about that. Let's charge you up. There you go. Some more starter ones going just to sell them make sure that uh, we're making as much money as we can there you go Is that Rufus where 
Oh, my garden. Essence of celery. Hey, you. I also need to plant her harvest here. Oh, but I have to water. That's okay. That gives me something to do. So yeah, he's gonna be pretty much like constantly working with a bot that's gardening because we are gardening so much. Just fill everything up. I know it takes a while, but it's worth it. Now the bot will come. Oh, I guess I did it. My bad. Look at that. But the bot's in the way. There you go. There we go. How's the bot doing on water? That's at 97%. That's really good. Alright, so we're at 330, so we're almost there. Is it still running? It is. Alright, we could crank some more. Let's see. What do we have multiple stacks of? We have multiple stacks of orange. Oh, we have the money now. Okay, so... Another one right next to it. And we'll do an orange and yogurt. I think that will be interesting. But if we do another fruit veggie... That's probably going to be the better option. Yeah. So we'll do an orange, I don't know. Oh, it would go well with orange. Orange cabbage or orange spinach. Oh, which one is this? This is spinach, so we probably want to do the cabbage. Orange. Cabbage. I'm gonna make it orange. Oh, interesting. Maybe I can, like, change it up and, like, have an increase to flavor. Uh, yogurt won't work. Could put spinach in here. You can put avocado. Hmm. Let's grab celery, too. Alright, what about cabbage, orange? Okay, orange, cabbage, avocado. Okay. Spinach orange. Spinach avocado. No. Celery orange. Celery avocado. So they're all neutral, so I might as well go for cabbage. There you go. And then I'll go grab this bot here. Because you need to grab the output from there, too. Oh, you can only do... Oh, I can't put it in that yet. Okay, so output, output, store. Okay. So I still have to manually stock them. Once this starts actually, once it actually gets a brew done. So these are all custom. So that will speed up that one. These 
different though. Oh, it's out of, okay. Avocado spinach, there we go. Avocado spinach. There you go. Ooh, blueprint. Tall can. Uh, much better. Okay. I have mail. Dang, two sodas brewing at once. You can't be stopped now. Anyway, you're probably just chucking in any two flavors to create your sodas. Although you can discover some... Uh, some good combinations by brute forcing things. It's much easier to analyze flavor cubes and discover the other flavors they pair well with before you start a new brew. Flavor combinations that are rated above neutral give a bonus to the value of the final soda. Bad combinations take away from the value, but they can also give some interesting effects when consumed. I'll send you a blueprint for the flavor cube analyzer. Build one and analyze a cube of your choice, either manually or automatically. That's cool. Uh, I didn't get it. Oh, it's over here. Okay. Oh, I also have a research point. So I think I'm going to get Stockbot. Yeah, I think I'm going to get Stockbot. Strawberry. Ooh. All right. Dog bots there. These are the bots. Flavor analyzer. I'm gonna pop it right up here. So then I can just grab something from in here, like, I don't know, avocado. Viable combinations found for their analysis. Okay, we'll do it manually. I don't understand. How do I do this? Drag the samples from the tray and place them on the grid. Two adjacent samples with the same number add and combine to a, into a single sample. Oh, ah, I see. So it's a little like mini game that I'm doing very poorly at. Oh, so it moves to the one that you most recently placed. Okay. Oops. I'll put that there. Oh boy. So it's a weird version of 2048, basically. I'll put a four here. It can go there. There we go. Sixty-four. That's pretty good. It's fun. I wouldn't want to do it for every single one, but it's not bad, honestly. I'm not pretending I'm good at it. That's for sure. We go we got it new discovery flavor combination avocado and grapefruit oh there's more i can find we'll auto analyze there you go instagro and essence of vanilla Ooh, got some emails daily summary okay i think it's time we take this to the next level the best of the soda brewers know that the only way they're going to break into big leagues is by studying consumer demand. I've unlocked the markets app for you. The production crew decided to keep it locked for the first week or so to create stupid reality TV drama. However, you have it unlocked early, so use it to your advantage. Inside the app, you can see all sorts of things to do with consumer demand. The list on the left displays the current demand for certain flavors of soda. 
You can also start marketing campaigns to target a particular consumer demographic if you want to try and sway the market a certain way. Now that you're probably asleep from reading all of this text, go look at some numbers to wake yourself up. Oh, okay. Interesting. Age group trends? Okay, wow. That's a lot. Gain 200 teen fans. Okay. Man, there's so much going on right now. I need another plot, though. you. You're also taking care of this. <laughs> I feel like this thing is not going to be able to keep up eventually. Doing a good job so far, but uh, how do you keep up with this? There's just so much. You know? Definitely a full-time job. Glad it's not my full-time job. Let's check how the avocado thing is going. I can do more research. Okay. Um. I got the stock bot. The sprinkler would be nice. But how does that work? Like placement of it. Oh, sweet. You can just do that. Oh, that's sick. Okay. I think I'll buy the stock bot before I do that. But that's sick. How's this guy doing? Go ahead and recharge him. Okay, so I want to get the stock bot, I think. them right here. Water them. Um, manage. So what I want you to do is take from here, input in here, input in here. Perfect. Ooh, more research points. Uh, ooh, I could just go straight to the drone sprinkler. That's way better. I like that. How expensive is it? 8,000. Honestly, might be worth it. But I think we'll start with the cheaper one. I think we'll start with these guys. Oh, our research is done. Avocado and orange. All right, I'll hand analyze. There you go. I have an idea of strategy for this game now. Though it's not ideal, as you guys can see. Still not really fully sure how I'm doing this. Dang it. That test tube is stuck in the middle. There we go. Um, eight can go here. Thirty-two. No. Oh, this is so messy. Trying to get those towards each other. There you go. Um, like so. That can go there. Oh no! <laughs> I didn't look at what was upcoming. I'm 
I'm so messy with how I play this. So bad at this, man. I wonder what happens if you fail. I mean, we'll probably find out in a second here. Uh... <laughs> Uh-oh. There you go! It was nice to be. Avocado and lemon. No more. Okay. We'll take avocado out. We know what it mixes with. The yogurt next. Uh, we have to hand analyze. So we don't have the money to do otherwise. There we go. Yeah, I'm not gonna pretend I'm good at this, that's for sure. I'm trying to like set this up to be able to combo well. But I keep screwing up my like ability to combo well. And so it just doesn't work. There we go. Yogurt and kale. Gotta keep hand analyzing for now. This there. Put that in the wrong spot. Very easy to do, honestly. That's the wrong spot, too. Mix those all up. That's the wrong spot. It's fine. I'm doing so bad. No. Fine. I'll just go like that and I'll figure it out later and it'll be fine. I'm no 16, so. Out of space. Oh, you have to like retry. Okay, I think it's better to auto. So just wait till I have the money. Let's see, what do I have a ton of? Oh, I should change one of these back to lemon lime. Um. What do I have? Green Machine actually sells really well. I'll actually keep doing Green Machine. I lied. But this one though is Orange Cabbage, which like doesn't seem to be doing very well. Orange Cabbage is for 290. This one's pretty good. Avocado Lemon. There you go. Then what do I have a lot of? Let's see. I think I can just straight sell some of these. No, I can't. 
That's all right. It's full. Can I get another fridge? I don't know how. I don't have the money for the advertising campaign. Yeah, I just need to use up some of my spares here, I think. Make sure there's space in this thing. I think I'll go for the social media thing next though, before I find any more dependencies. So it might be better to keep researching. Like researching the yogurt seems like it's gonna be really, really smart. At least to me. So, plus this is slowly happening on its own. I don't think I actually need to worry about it. I'd like to ship more soda cases at once though, but I think that's what I'll actually research next. I'll do one more case and then we'll uh, call it good. I'm gonna try and leave two spots left. I really need to research. Go ahead and water this stuff that doesn't auto water. Auto analyze yogurt. You know, I'm not using a lot of things. So right now we're just using lemon, avocado, and cabbage. So I could change what this is working on to uh, only do those. Like, I don't need these right now. As long as I have like a stack, there's no need to be getting them, you know? At least I, as long as I have some. Um, so lemon, avocado, I think this is cabbage here. There we go. Yogurt peach. I'll work on that once I do the uh, social media thing. I didn't mean to harvest that. Dang it. I just wanted to water it. I think that's going to be the problem we have right now. Everything that needs watering also needs uh, harvesting. Are you out of water? No, the inventory is just full. There you go, now you can like work a little bit. It can't work a lot is kind of like the big problem we're having. Um, I know there was like a thing. Oh my gosh, we're at 40 minutes again. Guys, <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this episode. Let me know what you guys think of this game so far. Am I doing the right research? Who knows? Um, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. And I will see all of you guys in the next one. 
Um, if you did enjoy this episode, make sure to leave a like, subscribe to me here on YouTube, and go follow me over on Twitch. I stream there four days a week. Thank you guys so, so much for watching, and I will see you in the next episode.